What's up everyone, this is Mr. King Lim here, and welcome to another episode of my Daughters of the Roses playthrough series. In the last episode, we defeated uh, Ishtar to earn our 7th Rose card, but now we've been called into battle at Bosworth to face Richard uh, Slicing of York, I think it says. This should be intriguing. Ah, oh, mountain. That could help blue eyes. Whoops. Slightly mucked up there. I'm going to presume this is a warrior deck. Right, that's what I meant to do. That might be needed. Oh, it was dead heat. Where was the dead heat? Also, I still don't get why wind turbines are in this game, considering this is supposed to be in the 1500s. Let's go with a warrior of a different kind. Ah, shoot. Oh well. Oh, fantastic. Payback time. And to make things better, in my hand I have a uh, Cyberstein, so it'll come in handy later. He falls for the bait. Mm. 
He did as well. 900 damage coming your way. Of course, if I can get Wasteland, that will be the ace. Megamorph, that's not bad. Which is he going to go for? Huh? Dragon Zombie was actually powerful enough. Surprising. Now Dragon Zombie will kill you with his bad breath. <laughs> Limiter removal, that's not bad. But I'm gonna hold out on that for now. Bear trap. Ah, oh, look, that paid off. Goodbye. Not bad, not bad, indeed. Oh, okay, never mind. Come on, he's not very good at this, is he? That's the second one of those which hasn't paid off. He's just attacking me, I'm not even attacking him. Okay, apart from still Ogre, still Grotta Ogre. Okay, well, I think it's time we advanced. what he does now. Oh yeah, I learned my mistake from last time. Although it is a machine... Uh, I don't know. What 
We'll see what happens. Oh, I haven't seen battle ox yet. Okay, now I might need some more... Let's see, 22, so I'll just put this down for now. That's good. He, he took the bait. So he's now in the thousand, I believe. Correct. Oh, you're the Panther Warrior. That can't be good. Thirty-two hundred. Okay, now I have a serious problem. I don't think I have any choice, I have to use Megamorph. That should buy me a little bit of time. Phew. That was too close. Be patient, bide your time. It's 
Sometimes I don't understand cards. I see. Alright, oh, power up. Right. Dimwits. Oh, dang it. Although, he's took the bait, which is intriguing. Let's just quickly activate limiter removal. So in the end, that mistake actually provided me with the opportunity to win the match. Nicely done. Now what are we going to get? Oh, a wire, I wouldn't mind that. Oh, garbage. Oh, I was one off getting a full sweep. Again. Eh. Uh. I don't have the best of luck. Pegasus is a. Uh, Pegasus is a. Uh, joins the Red Rose. Hmm. 
So, it looks like the war is won. But now we just need to deal with Seto. So, in the next episode, we will finally be taking on the final Rose Duelist, Kaiba. Seto, I should say. Now, this definitely is not going to be an easy one. I remember the first time I ever faced Kaiba, it took, it took around about seven attempts to defeat him. So, this isn't going to be easy. But we'll find out what happens in the next video. So that was another episode of my Duelist of the Roses series. If you enjoyed this video then please make sure to like this video and also subscribe to the channel to know when my newest content is coming out. Also be free to check out my previous Duelist of the Roses content as well. I hope you've enjoyed this episode and for now, this is Mr King Lim, signing out.